All right, what's good, YouTube? Nate and Hazel with Mass Collector. And what are we doing today? King Shaky. King Shaky. So we are doing Storytime Chess, which is a game for to get young people started playing chess. And it's built around stories um, that teach kids how to move the pieces and things of that nature so we actually um we went through the first chapter already didn't we what was the first chapter about king king chomper king chomper right and king, king. chomper how many spaces can king chomper move one one space yeah which way can he move he can move he can move this way. He can move sideways. Yeah. And he can move forward. Forward. And backward. And. What is it? Diagonal. Diagonal. Yep. Diagonal. 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 Yep. Right. And why can he only move one space? Because, because, because he's so afraid. Chomper is? Or because he got a big belly? Because he has a big belly. And he eats lots of food? Yeah. And he can only move one space at a time. Yeah, like. Yep. Why what, we what, what are his tokens like? Pizzas? Yeah, and then his is like gold. Yeah. So we learned about King Chomper, and King Chomper is the white piece, the, the white king. And then um, we and did the. He's only. One slow step at a time. And he's got he's such a big belly. King. Yep. And then we have King Shaky next, who is on the black side of the board for the king. So it was pretty neat. You know, it goes through um, how to make King Chomper move and what his capabilities are. You know, in one space, he's a king. <laughs> and then it gives you some mini games to do. First you put straight and then the circle and then the square. Yep, first we did straight. So he took one space, ate one piece of pizza at a time. And then what did you do after you uh, ate a piece of pizza? Did you take your hand off the piece to make everybody let you know that you were you're done with your move? Yeah. Yeah. And what do we do after we finish the the lesson? We, we do a different shake we, we hands. Shake hands, yeah. And then we did another mini game. So this one here, we got to move him diagonal and backwards and forwards. And, and then we did a game where we scattered pizza tokens all over the board, <laughs> right? And then we moved and took the hand off the piece. Moved, took the hand off the piece, ate a piece of pizza, things like that. And then now we're at the point where we're going to turn the page to meet his King Chomper's friend, King Shaky. Right? Yeah. And he wasn't so let's put King Chomper away. Yeah. Put him back in his sack. Yeah. That's all, all his, his people. With all his other friends. Other tokens and uh, pieces are in there. And friends. And friends, yep, yeah, and his queen. And we got King Shaky's bag is right here. With the black chess pieces. Yeah, black chess. Yep. Yeah. So, alright, so here we go. So King Shaky lived very close to King Chomper in Chesslandia, just on the other side of the checkered lawn. So here's our checkered lawn. So here, right here you can see this is the white side of the board. So here's King Chomper. It's really cool. They put little diagrams for each for each player piece so you know where to stack them you know the pawns go here and then you got your rook knight bishop what do you can king. walk on top yep and then the other side's got king shaky's players. i want to do it on top i want to do so he doesn't need to go right there well you got to put them down there though right so um the checkered lawn the other side of the board is just a regular chess board which is cool um King Shaky was a silly king because he lived in a silly castle. Most kings live in castles made of stone, brick, and cement. But King Shaky's castle was made entirely out of pillows. Yeah. Yep, pillows. pillows. King Shaky's castle had a pillow walls, pillow floors, pillow ceilings, and pillow doors. And when he falls, he doesn't block his head on there. Right, 
Yeah. And King Shanky never went outside because he was too afraid of anything that wasn't a pillow. King Shaky was afraid of cheese. He was afraid of trees. He was afraid of his knees. And he was super afraid of bumblebees. And he's afraid of the grass. And he's afraid of the grass, yeah. King Shaky had a fun morning ritual. He woke up in his pillow bed, walked across his pillow floor, and opened up his pillow box full of King Jewels. There, the, there was one okay. jewel for every color of the rainbow. Then King Shaky picked up his jewels and let them fall through his fingers back into the box. It was a cushioning life. All right. Now, King Shaky was so scared of the bee. But one morning, there was a disaster. King Shaky was letting his jewels fall through his hands when a bumblebee flew in the window and landed on them, mistaking them for flowers. King Shaky was so scared of the bee that he accidentally threw all of his Jews out the window. Oh no, he had never left his safe pillow castle, but now his jewels were scattered all over the checkered lawn. What will King Shaky do? He will, he's got it, and he's got to go everywhere. You think he's got to go find all his, his jewels? Yeah. Alright, so we have jewel tokens we'll, we'll need, I'm sure. So... We'll put some of these, flip them over to the jewel side. Okay. Make sure we got enough of those. Okay, so King Shaky walked out of his pillow room and down his pillow steps, cracked open the pillow front door to take a peek and saw his jewels twinkle on the checkered lawn. Then he remembered that courage means doing something even though you're afraid to do it. So King Shaky decided to be brave and tie pillows all over his body like pillow armor and go outside even though he was so scared of the grass. King Shaky thought the grass was dangerous so he tiptoed one slow step at a time. One step, pick up a jewel. One step, pick up a jewel. <laughs> King Shaky collected all of his jewels and eventually made it back to his cozy pillow castle. Being brave made King Shaky <laughs> feel very proud of himself. I want to, do you want a pillow thing? Do you want to live in a pillow, Daddy? Do I want to live in pillows? Yeah. Kind of. And then we got to cook pillows. Yeah. All right, so here we go. How to move King Shaky. King Shaky, the black king, only moves one step or square per turn on the chessboard. He can move forward. Okay, Hazel, you listen. Ready? He can move forward. He can move backwards. Sideways and diagonally. 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 Yep. So one spot at a time, right? I gotta get it on the So square. we've got our chessboard out. We play the story side up with the lawn. Take out the black king chess piece and insert the corresponding king shaky on there, which we did. You see right here. And place the king shaky chess piece on a starting square. Here you go. Put him on a starting square. Where's he go? How did you know that? Because I saw the picture. There you go. Very good. So that's where we're at. So say out loud, King Shaky takes one step. Take took one slow step at a time. Because he, because he was afraid of the grass. Yes, he was. Very good. All right. So we're gonna move on to King Shaky's games. Okay. Oh, look at that. It's kind of similar, isn't it, to what King Chomper did? So. King Shaky mini game number one. We're gonna move the king one step at a time. So we're gonna place King Shaky on the starting square over here on the board. On the story side of the chessboard, King Shaky's starting square is in front of the picture on his face. I'm gonna put these here. So use jewel tokens to create one continuous path to the opposite side of the board. Place one jewel token on each square. Start with the square in front of King and make sure there are no empty spaces between the jewel tokens. So, ready? We're gonna put these. I want to this one. Here, put, we need two more jewels in these two spots. One more. All right, put the rest in the box over here. So don't lose them. Put them right in the box so we don't lose them. You don't need those. No, not yet. Okay, 
One square is one step. Where's King Shaky go on, his, on the board on the spot, right? King Shaky moves to the square with the jewel token that is one step away. King Shaky stays on the square and you pick up the jewel token, removing it from the board. You must take your hand off of the chess piece, right? And leave King Shaky on his new square. This indicates that the move is complete. Then repeat by moving King Shaky one more square to get to the next jewel token, okay? I love you too. Come on. So, okay, get the first jewel. Yeah. It's like, it's gonna hold like that. Or we can put it on Now, where does King Shaky go? He goes on the spot. And take your hands off, right? Now, we're just gonna take the jewel and move it off the board. So, move it over here, okay? For your stack. Okay. Oh, now, do we need this card? We don't need that one, right? That's not part of the game. Do you want to pick up the rest of the jewels? So. Do you want to play the way that we're supposed to play? Okay, so get your next jewel. Move them up. And go. Yep. And next. No, take your hand off. Take your hand off, yep. Move one spot. And take your hand off. And put your movers, you gotta move them up here now, remember? And now take your hand off. Yep. Get the hand of jewel. Yep. And take your hand off. We gotta move them first. So you take your jewel, move him, and then take your hands off. Yep. And then there's two more. Take my hands off. Yep, and last one. Woo! And you gotta move them to the last spot. Okay, All right, you got it. Now what? We shake hands. Yeah, and high five. All right, good job. Yeah, up here. So King Shaky can move one spot at a time, right? All right, now. You know what? On Friday she has a, today she had the same stuff on. Exactly, that's me. But you don't have that same shirt on. Hazel. Can you sit in the, in your spot so we can play the number two game? Number two, number two. Remember this one? Yeah, you go around and around and around and around. So let's just we'll move him back so we can. All right, ready? Yes. Mini game number two. So move the king in all directions now instead of just forward. So this is where the part of the game where we did it last time where Hazel started to get a little um, bored, so to speak, right? Is it taking too long? We only got this, this mini game left. And this one, and then we're done. Oh man! And then King Look Chomper. At King Chomper and King Shaky on here at the same time. <laughs> here, let's get these now. Remember how to do that? So go get one piece. I want this one. Move it and move it. What is it called? Which way are you on this way? Yeah. Diagonal. Diagonal. So you move him over there. Take the jewel off. Move King Shaky to that spot. Take your hand off. Okay. Perfect. Now. So when you move King Shaky, you tell us which way you're going to move. I'm going to do a diagonal. Okay. And move him into a spot. Go where to say. Yep. Okay. Now which way are you going to move him? Diagonal. You like that word? Yeah. All right. Go ahead. I like diagonal. Diagonal is a good word. Move him in the spot. Take your hand off. And okay. I'm moving back. Now which way are you going to go? Diagonal. Alright. I like diagonal. Yeah. 
Move him to a spot and take your hand off. Right. Uh, you took this one, remember? Okay, now move him back. Take your hand. Okay, now which way are you going to go? Which these are diagonal. You can, well, you got to go get your jewel so you can move sideways or forward or backwards. Which way are you going to go? I'm going to go backwards. Alright. No, I'm not. I'm going to go this way. Okay. Move him into a spot. Alright. Now I'll move him back. Now which way? This again. Sideways? Yeah. Okay. Move him to your spot. You take a jewel, you gotta move to that spot. There you go. Now move. Now, which way would you want to? Let's let's say you start here. Which way can you go? This backwards and forward. Diagonal. If he's if he's if he's here, this is diagonal, right? Mhm. Mm so you can go diagonal again if you want. Diagonal. All right. Diagonal. Put him back there in the spot. Take your hand off so we know that the move is done. Okay, now if you want to get this guy backwards two times, right? Two spaces? Yeah! Yep, yep. move him back. Alright, hands off. Hand off. Shake hands. Good job. And high five! And high five. Alright, next game. Alright, so oh. now we got. King Shaky mini game three. Now it's time for both kings to play together. Randomly scattered jewel tokens and pizza tokens all over the board. Each side picks either King Shaky or King Chomper and places them on the starting squares. On the story board, you will see. Why is he That's going off because mommy got Amazon in. Okay. Why does he keep doing that? She got three packages, so it's gonna ding for everyone. They're facing each other. Come on, buy each other. Why you talking about it? Because we need tokens. Ah, token, 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 right. token, token, token. Okay, ready? Take turns moving King Shaky and King Chomper one step at a time to collect all of their own tokens. King Shaky picks up the jewel tokens. King Chomper picks up pizza tokens. After each move, you must leave your king on the square and take your hand off the piece. This indicates the end of your move. Remember, not every square has a token on it. You may have to land on an empty square to get closer to a token. If you move on to a square with no token on it, that still counts as your turn. Goal, whichever king picks up all of their tokens first wins. When you have finished this activity, shake hands and say, good game. You can repeat the exercise if you like or clear the board. All right. I'll take these. I'm going to do these ones. All right, so I'm King Chomper. You're King Shaky. Or do you want to be King Chomper? I'm going to do this. Okay. So put the jewels up. And we're going to put pizza tokens around the board. Randomly. Now remember, you can only get your own tokens, right? First me. First me. Okay, we both got it. Yep. So now you because go. Because I'm ordered. Well, technically, the first move should be with the white king because the, the white pieces move first in chess. So can daddy go first? Yeah. Okay, so Daddy's going to move sideways. He's going to go get this one. But he's going to move one step at a time. So that's my move. Now it's Hazel's turn. Okay, I'm going to get that one. Okay, so now take your hand. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You can only move one square at a time. Right? So now your your turn's done. Now my turn. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take this token like that and move my hand off. And now it's Hazel's turn. Then go get that No, get that one, honey. That one's right there. One space away. You can only move one space. Ready? Okay. Now Daddy's going to go and get that one. So he's going to move this space up here. And then that's it. One space at a time. Hazel's turn. 
get your jewels. Okay, don't, Hazel, one space at a time. Okay, this is one space. This is the next space. So you got one move. I can't even know how to do this part. Well, that's why we're here to learn. This is how we learn. Okay? Mm. So I got this one. My turn's done. Hazel, your turn. Once you get, now you can get this guy. Okay. Now you can get your jewel. Right here? Right there, honey. You gotta collect your jewels. You move one space at a time. Put your king in the space after you take the jewel. Now it's daddy's turn. And he can't, he can't get to this one because it's two spaces away. So he's gonna go here. Hazel's turn. I gotta walk up. Yep. Diagonal. Yep. Hazel, you have to wait. That does not two. That's two spots away. Okay. Mm. This is how it plays. You can only move one spot at a time. But remember. I did. But you started to take the jewel. You gotta wait till your next turn. Now your turn. Why no. can't you do that then? Because I was only one space away. Now you're one space away. Now you can get it. See? Now move your guy up there. Okay. My daddy's turn. It's going here. Now your turn. I can only go one space at a time. See, now you're one space away from that. Look at that. I can get it now. Yeah, diagonal. Move him over there. Then daddy's turn. And he's still one space away. So now your turn. Now look at where you're at. Diagonal. Yeah, I can get it. Yep. Move your king. So daddy's going to take his. Now your turn again. Now look where you're at. I can take it. The diagonal again? Yeah. Put your, put your piece over there. Uh oh, I think Daddy's gonna lose. Okay, now your turn. Now you gotta come get these. So you move one space back. One space, Hazel. No, I can take them. No, you gotta leave them there. Okay, you were right here. You can only move one square at a time, right? So that's it for that move. Now Daddy's turn, and he can only move one space. Remember? Now King Shaky's turn. One space. Right here. Yep. Wait, no, no, one space. There was no jewel here, right? Okay, that's it. Now your turn. Now you can get one. You move, yep. Make sure you move your king in that spot now that you took the token off of. Move him up there, yep. And then daddy's gonna take this piece of pizza. And then he's king shaky. Got one jewel left. Can I take it? Yep. Yeah. One spot. I... Move them there. And now you won. Yay! Good job. Shake hands. Say good game. Good game. <laughs> All right. So that's the uh, that's King Shaky story adventure time. Um, the one thing that it did say in the book to do was to replay you know the the chapters of the king for about a week until you really get it nailed down um as far as the movements are concerned I which want to do a different people you want to do different people mm -hmm. i want to do other people okay well we're going to stop this video for now because this is the one chapter one and two so thanks everybody for tuning in to nate and hazel a mass collector doing our story time chess journey um i used to play chess quite a bit when i was younger um trying to teach hazel how to play and this this game popped up and we thought it was really cool so we're gonna document our progress here so right now we've been through both kings and done the the games and she kind of really liked that one yeah she really likes it so far gets a little bored um after the first couple mini games because it's I don't know, maybe it's just the, she's expecting something more with it right now, but um, it's pretty cool. There you go, this way. Okay. And that's, your, that's the queen. We'll get to queen that one later. Shaky. Yep. So thanks everybody for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Uh, we'll do a playlist in our channel. Can we do this one? Hang on, honey. 
we'll um, do a playlist where we'll put all the videos in. So if you're checking back to see where we're at, you can just go to that playlist and, and avoid the other videos that I put out with sports cards and things like yeah. that. So thank you so much. We appreciate it. Please yeah. like and Let's thumbs shake up. Hand. Shake hands. Shake hands and Let's high speak. five. And high five. All right. All right. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next time. Want to see a big one? Bye bye. Let's do a big one. Oh. Wow. All right. Bye. That hurt it, Say bye-bye. Did that hurt? No. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye.